Hey guys, Mr. D here again with another tech news update. So Computex is still currently going on, and yesterday AMD announced their anticipated Polaris GPU, the Radeon RX 480. The card is expected to hit shelves later on this month, although no exact dates have been revealed yet. The card is going to be $200 for the 4GB version, so we're sure to see a very good performance to dollar ratio. AMD made direct comparisons with the GTX 1080's Founder Edition during their presentation saying you can have better performance with the two RX 480s in Crossfire for under $500 versus a single GTX 1080 at around $700. The RX 480 will be pushing just over 5.8 teraflops of computing performance and will come sporting either 4 or 8 gigabytes of GDDR5 memory with information being sent across a 256-bit bus. The craziest thing about the card is its power consumption or lack thereof. Using only 150 watts, for reference, the R9 390X uses a whopping 275 watts. So we're looking at a big jump in power efficiency. As far as styling, AMD is going back to the same design as the previous years with the reference blower cooling system. This is all great news for those who want to play demanding games and even use VR, but don't want to break the bank doing so. The only downside is, since AMD is keeping costs down on their cards, they're only targeting the mid-range performance users, and thus, it's pretty much all but guaranteeing NVIDIA the title of top performer for now, even if it does come at a premium. On the NVIDIA side of things, since the initial launch, it's been pretty hard to get the GTX 1080 since they all sell out pretty quickly. On Amazon, we're seeing third-party sellers price gouging the GTX 1080. I've seen prices as high as $1,700. Needless to say, resist the urge to buy these, since, as one reviewer said, you can buy two GTX 1080s for that price. Just be sure to be on the lookout as more websites replenish their stock. I'll be putting some of the links in the description below. That's all for now guys. What do you guys think about the RX 480? Are you going to get one or two of these? Or are you going to stick with Nvidia? Comment below and let me know. Also, be sure to hit that thumbs up and subscribe. See you next time here at Mr. D Tech News and Reviews.